is Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode two of season two of the Demon Girl Next Door. So it's going to get started in three, two, one, go. <coughs> ah! Well, hello there. Oh. Oh, you're right. I literally forgot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Is it bad that I really want Shamiko's sister Ro to become a magical girl? I mean, technically, we kind of got, like, something with it in season one, but it didn't really follow through. Because it's the dress code, boo boo. Yeah, do you want Shamiko to get arrested? No. And, and plus, she's a minor. There's pedophiles all over. Like, seriously, this opening literally is, like, anime of the season for opening-wise. Because, like, oh, when I heard this last week, I was just like, oh, this is so damn good. Like, as good as season one's opening and just the way that it looks. It's just, they was like, hey, let's take everything that everybody liked in season one's opening and just, like, mwah. Over a thousand. Like, whoever that girl in the gray is who's just walking there and she has her little oversized, like, dress or, like, nightgown. She's so fucking cute and I hope we get to see her later on in the show. Because, oh my god, when I saw her, she was just like, I'm in the middle. I am the center. I'm here walking. I was like, oh, she, she, she's just the queen. She is the star. She is the moment. She is like, I am here. Pay attention to me. But yeah, of course, like, it's so fucking cute. And it's very jazzy, and I really like that. It's calm, cool, collective. This could be one, another one of those songs that, like, I end up putting on my phone several months later, or if it is already out on iTunes buy the damn song and put it on my Apple Music account and ish because like oh too damn good. Really, Cody? <laughs> hmm? Aww. Yeah, it even has our name on it, kind of. Shamiko's mom would be drunk right now. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh. 
Unfortunately, yes. Oh, um, you know, mm, that's not good. <laughs> Baby is getting spidered. <laughs> Kind of fell for me, Don. Oh, like, what's her face for my angel food down to me? <laughs> Do you have pictures? Food. Momo as a baby magical girl. Oh my god. She's so fucking adorable. What the hell is that? <laughs> oh, yeah, because remember, you, you can't cook as well. Oh, baby. Well, you know, they, she said it was rice balls, but you know, 
Maybe Shamiko needs to help them on how to cook. I mean, we learned that, damn, last week. <laughs> Hey, buddy. Yeah, because that looks like a, yeah, that looks like a cherry blossom. <laughs> Fingers crossed we get to see that this season. Yeah, I mean, she ain't Mary Poppins. The child just threw it like it was nothing. Oh my god. wine that's a fork
Yeah. Yeah, you know, maybe you need to go see someone, baby. Yeah, you want to go home, get some medicine, sleep? You need sleep. Yeah, you didn't do that. Oh. <laughs> She just used sus. <laughs> oh, I can't. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Why is it moving like that? Clay shouldn't move like <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, it looks like that. It's the same one that's in the opening that she's holding. this show so damn much. <laughs> oh, which of a collie ride. <laughs> Poor baby. You want some water? The adorable ride, the awesome ride. The acute rod. <laughs> <laughs> Once again, I can't wish Shami Cole's mom. <laughs> yeah, hold on to that fork until we find out what it's called. <laughs> What if it's called, like, the All-Star? <laughs> the All-Star Run.
fork, baby. You just made it into a bigger fork. <laughs> Oh, it transformed into a pen. That's cool. Well, you know, a couple of hours too late, shall we go? Yeah, I don't really think there was a time we ever really saw him almost, no. Huh? I know, because that's your girlfriend, and you want to make your girlfriend smile. Because, see, it's worse. Freaking Kita, the freaking Kita Fantasy game. The last time that I saw something in that game that this show has mentioned, there was an art of Shami Cole and Momo was together, and I was just like, they're just girlfriends chilling at the pool, eating something sweet. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> baby tried. <laughs> Honestly, if I do find that that uh that freaking art. <laughs> I might have to post that on my Twitter because, like, the first time that I saw it, I was like, oh my god, look at this. Because the one thing that I like about the Kid of Fantasia uh, mobile game is that when a show that has been created by these people who created so many different, you know, mangas and such for their manga time Kirara series, they all get to be together. And so a lot of people really want the Kid of Fantasy um, series to be in an anime and such. Hell, I want it. I mean, it'd be nice to see all those characters pop up once again. I mean, you know, look at Isekai Quartet, that one show that featured the cast of, I think it's Angel Beats. Um, that one other show that's just as sad. Clannad. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will never watch Clannad again. Don't ever ask me. No. Fuck no. That's a hard <laughs> That hurt me and you know, I don't want to cry. But yeah, okay, today's episode was sweet. I, I'm, you know, I'm wondering how in the world Shamiko is going to transform this quote-unquote magical fork back into <laughs> a magical girl one. I mean, it's cute. We already know what it was going to look like because of the opening. Because both Momo and Shamiko are both using their wands. Um, I love how we got to get a little focus on Mikan because Mikan, when we met her in season one, we really knew little, <laughs> little to none about her. So I'm glad that she kind of got a little more development because Mikan is very interesting. Oh my god, look at baby! <laughs> Mikan is a very interesting character. She, you know, I think the one thing I like about Mikan is... Because she is someone who represents, like, an orange in a way. She's always very happy, happy and such. But also seeing at a time of her life when she was younger, um, she was sad. Like, that fucking hurt. Also seeing baby freaking Momo. Like, oh my god. And such. Baby Momo. Fucking adorable. Momo in general. Fucking adorable. Like, Momo could literally just chill for a whole episode. And I'd just be like, she's fucking adorable and she's the best fucking girl in the entire damn series. Like, she you know, <laughs> the reason why I live. <laughs> but yeah, I love the fact that we get to now see these three hang out a lot more. I do also like the fact that even though Shamiko's friends, aka the two who got to have a little moment in this episode, 
Um, it seems like, since we're now two weeks into this show, they're not going to be as important as they were kind of going into season one. Because season one, they were almost in, like, every single episode. So now, I think with season two, they're going to be kind of the minor cast of the show, where we're probably going to have little special moments with them. And it might be like, okay, so now we're going episode two. They might not be featured until about two or three weeks later down on the line with this show. If you see where I'm getting at and stuff. And I'm not mad with that. I just do like the fact that we're getting that. I'm okay with like going a week or two without seeing certain characters who are not as important um, to the plot. I love seeing Ro uh, Ro because she's one of like her, it's Shamigo's sister. It's like best fucking sister, so I do hope we get to see a little bit more of her because I enjoyed her in season one. So, finger crossed for season two. Hopefully, she does get to be, you know, like a magical girl esque something because I feel like she deserves it. But of course, we ain't gonna know. Of course, Shamiko's mom's gonna be in it because Shamiko's freaking mom. I feel like we're gonna have a lot more drunk moments with Shamiko's mom because, I mean, this was just fucking hilarious. Both to see her and the ancestor both effing drunk off their feet. Like, bruh, was not expecting that in today's episode. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode two of season two of The Demon Girl Next Door. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. <clears throat> also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys either next Thursday or next Friday for episode three. Bye, guys.